up YouTube? What is up my people? Oh, place that I go put on this blinker in a good manner. It's uh, very respectful to other people on the road. But in this video I just want to talk a little bit about from what I've been reading the last couple of days that Harley is extremely hard for Ducati because I guess Volkswagen is thinking about focusing uh, more on their core products and possibly putting Ducati up for sale for a rumored like around 1.5 billion euros which is a pretty penny I guess there's a company called uh, in Invest, uh, invest something. I can't remember the exact name. I'll put it up. And uh, they own about 49% of Ducati. And they're looking to uh, try and get the whole, the whole company, if they can get enough money together because that's a lot of money is scaring off a lot of competitors BMW has said that you know their spokesman has said that they're, they're not interested but Harley is interested and that would be a big change that would be huge for Harley to go at Ducati I guess uh, Harley Davidson's rumored to put some offers in early July or something so that would be interesting because 1.5 billion, that's a lot of money, and but Ducati would help out Harley Davidson a lot. I guess there was an email sent to a journalist from a Ducati spokesperson that said Harley Davidson is decades behind the technology that Ducati is. So for them to acquire Ducati would be absolutely fantastic for them. I don't know how all these. Uh, Ducati fans, I know the uh, union, labor union for Volkswagen is not, is 100% against for selling Ducati. They want to keep it in the company. But with Volkswagen's, the last couple years with all the scandals and stuff, they're facing billions and billions of dollars in fines and all that fucking nonsense. So. They're looking to, uh, you know, kind of revamp their company and focus strategically on their core. And Ducati, it's a motorcycle company. It's not a car company. Volkswagen's a car automotive company. They make, you know, uh, some of their subsidiaries or whatever. Make airplane engines and all that shit. So, we'll see. Volkswagen's a big company. I know their unions against it, but that's not going to stop. That's not going to stop them. That'd be good news for Harley, though. But 1.5 billion euros—that's that's what Volkswagen's going for, anyway. So who knows if that would actually, you know, that Harley could throw, you know, a million at them. I don't know what that is, U.S. So I'm going to continue talking in euros for that stuff because that's a lot of the stuff I've been reading is things in Europe. So that's pretty cool. That's big news for Harley Davidson. I suggest looking into Google and that shit. Looking more into it, reading it. Bunch of different uh, bunch of different news sources and whatnot like I did. And Harley Davidson, that's fantastic news. Good for them, good for them. I hope they can go through with it because that would be a huge merger. I'm sure Ducati fans are probably hoping no, but Harley Davidson's got a big pocket. They have half the American economy, or, uh, motorcycle industry in their pocket. They are hurting for sales, and Ducati had an estimated, I think, like 550 million euros, like revenue for 2016. So that would help out a lot. So go check that shit out. That's just my little, my little news flash motorcycle news flash if you will on that so keep an eye out this is just talks for now but it's looking pretty pretty promising we'll see what happens in the future in the, in the near future because if it does go through Harley Davidson will own Ducati by the end of the year if not 
because there's a lot of investment companies looking into this so we'll see what happens you guys ride safe take care google that Peace.